sir. We are inaugurating our Bangalore clinic. We have our clinic in Delhi, in Gurgaon, and Noida. This is a new one. We are in homeopathic line since our institute is established in the year 1980, about 105 years old. Dr. Pareshnath Banerjee, who established the charitable dispensary at Ugija, is a small town in Dhakar. That dispensary is still persisting and the complete charitable. There is no charges. Medicines are given at free of cost. It is continued. Parishnat Banerjee popularized homeopathy in treating most complicated cases in those days. And the media became famous for homeopathic treatment. People used to come from all over India, even from the abroad, to see Dr. Parishnat Banerjee for the homeopathic treatment. After him, Dr. Porimal Banerjee took the charge and he expanded and he expanded the research work also in homeopathy. His institute was International Institute of Advanced Homeopathy. He developed many protocols. We are all Dr. Porimal Banerjee's student. <coughs> and Porimal Banerjee's elder child is the mother of Dr. Kushal Banerjee. And all doctors, our seniors, Dr. Dr. Manisha Sethi, Dr. Vijus Dapto, who was all student of Dr. Porimal Banerjee. Now, this is the new clinic we are opening in Bangalore and people used to come in our daily cleaning from Bangalore for a long time because I am in Delhi for almost almost 47 years. So people used to travel all the way from the Bangalore patient used to travel all the way to New Delhi and they have been demanding for this clinic for a long time. Then Dr. Kushal took the initiative and he started coming here, he used to sit in hotels from the hotel and used to see patients. Now we have got this place and we'll start in full swing and our junior doctors, Dr. Ganga, Dr. Vidhi, Dr. Kushbu, they will be available all weekdays. And whatever the serious consultation is, Dr. Kushal will be visiting regularly. And whatever the serious consultation or emergency cases are required, it will be done through the video conference or email consultation. And in case of emergency cases, Dr. Kushal will come to Bangalore. Because most of the serious cases means cancer organ failure, renal failure, liver failure, these are the cases, these are the diseases, homeopathy has got better response. And many cases we have seen, they have survived on the cancer or renal failure, liver failure, just taking the homeopathic medicines. So just to help the people of Bangalore, we are operating this clinic and I hope people will get the benefit of their problem with this I talk to. Thank you very much. We have all taken trouble to attend our function. I really thank you very much for coming here. Doctor, the uh, uniqueness of your uh, clinic when compared to other clinics, what is the uniqueness of your clinic? The uniqueness of the clinic is because we see the patient which are more complicated. People that patients are diffused by everybody. But even then, we treat them and we get the very good results. Doctor, according to you, mm -hmm. what is the success rate 
in case of cancer and thyroidism? Well, that is all depends. That is all depends. The cancer and renal failure disease or liver failure disease is all depending the stages of the disease. If the people come early, definitely percentage of success is very high. When compared to allopathy? Yes, even compared to allopathy. Many, many allopathic uh, sort of failures or those who have not responded with the chemotherapy and all. They do respond with it, but many cases are there. What is the stage homeopathy appears fully in case of uh, this one? Because that is even very advanced cases, fourth stage or so. So where we didn't expect that the patient will respond, we are trying to give the relief only. But we have seen the cases have responded very nicely. And they have a long life. I have many cases, they are surviving, there is no hope. There are all the doctors, the Tata Institute in Bombay, all India Medical Institute, they have tried everything, they have left where we will we'll survive for another three to six months. But we have got many cases, they are surviving 20, 25 years, just whole particular cases. Sir, what are diseases you are uh, treating here? Almost all diseases. Nowadays, cancer has become a very common problem. Hmm. Like cough and cold. In our student days, we used to see very real. And now the pa patients are waiting in the line with the cancer cases. Then renal failure. Organ failure also has increased very much. Hmm. Renal failure, liver failure, cirrhosis of the liver. Then many neurological problems like multiple sclerosis, MND, MND is also very difficult disease, very difficult to treat, but we have been able to stable it for some time. So, like brain tumor and many, many other problems, the arthritis, skin problems, then the children catch a cold frequently, Breathing problem. These are can be treated homeopathically very nicely and people do respond.